<laughs> that like being in Antigua at 1.25 a.m. drinking a $60 bottle of Johnny Walker Blue Label that I bought at the gift shop here because I was bored. Went to the casino tonight and uh, I won 90 but instead of walking away, of course, I sat there and then I lost 660. <laughs> oh, what a night. Uh, I probably had about 15, 20 rum and cokes. And what they give you here is like one little tiny shot. So I bought a bottle of this. So I'll finish off tonight with this one. It's tasting good, my friends. I wish you could be here to see the beauty of Antigua and this resort. It's alright. The staff are okay. Some of them think that they own the food here, which is fucked up. And they close the buffet certain days of the week, which is absolutely dumb. But it's good. I'm enjoying myself. Having a little drink. Probably at the bed. My face is sore as hell. I know you can see that. Oh yeah, peeling real bad. Basically pull it off. I was out on the sea for like almost two hours. And uh, one guy was giving me like an excursion, taking me all around, showing me all the stuff in different islands and stuff. And the water and the wind blowing on you felt so good that you didn't realize, you know, the sun is burning the shit of you. I had aloe on, I had sunscreen on, and I just sweated it all off and the salt water just took it off anyway. Because it was just splashing on my face, jumping the waves and stuff behind boats. But yeah, it's uh, it's not so bad now as it was yesterday. But last night it was kind of sore trying to sleep. My face was all pinched up laying on the pillow. But it, it was good. I had a good time. Uh, today, yeah, I just went in earlier today into uh, St. John's, into the capital of Antigua. Walked around. It was kind of disappointing. Went and got a haircut. Uh, walked around a bunch of shopping plazas, which everything was way overpriced for all the tours they come in on the cruise ships and there was none there today it was empty because it's off season right now so they don't make as many stops here but uh... it was alright nice people everyone trying to sell you something but uh... i bought one lousy uh, shirt actually i broke out and bought it i know i get ripped off one person offered it to me for six and i ended up going buying off some other guy for fifteen dollars just because of the guy the hell with it which is this one here it's like this tropical fruity color, bright color it has a collar only one restaurant here there's like four a la carte at uh, Jolly Beach Resort and one of them you have to wear pants and a shirt with a collar so I only have one pair of jeans with me I didn't think I'd be wearing any pants over here so that's my one shirt now with the collar so Whatever works to get in the door to get the free food. Uh, today's Friday the 1st of June. So, I leave here on Sunday and I go down to the Catamaran Hotel. And it's like a small family run one in uh, Falmouth Harbor, close to English Harbor. In the south, like the middle south part going towards uh, the eastern side of the island. Uh, I stopped there the other day and looked at it after I come back from zip lining and sting on, uh, swimming with the stingrays. It's a nice looking place. So it's going to be different there. Here everything is included, down there nothing is. So, yep. Just trying not to spend no more money now after I lost all that at the casino. <laughs> but I'm having a good time. Uh, just wanted to share a little something something with you. I don't know, a little bit of a uh, kind of a personal blog, I guess. But uh, this is me. This is what I did this year. This is what I did for the summer. Been over to the UK too much. Been over to uh, France. Been over to Asia. Love Thailand. Thought Thailand was the best place I was at so far. And uh, I like Antigua. It's very nice. But I think the Dominican Republic was more happening. There was more to do. There was a little cheaper and it was a little bit nicer where I was at. I think this is a three plus star or four star resort. And uh, the other place where I stayed in the Dominican was a uh, four star and it was so much better here they don't even give you bottles of water they don't give you uh, 
nothing. Basically, they give you go to the bar and you get like a glass of pop or a glass of this like syrup juice or a, like any liquor that you want. Basically, that they got there, but nothing in a can of water. You get a bite. It's like two fifty U.S. for a can of pop, which is nuts. Even when you go in town, it's it's not cheap. It's still like two bucks, two twenty-five U.S. So you save like maybe quarter fifty cents depending on where you go. But the restaurants in town, there's a lot of good restaurants. I never had a chance to eat at none of them. I was looking at the food. But uh, they want so much money again. Like, uh, Well, I'm here till Sunday. This is probably out of everywhere I've been on the island, get the nicest beach. So basically, this is what you're paying for. You're paying for the beach. Everything else is kind of just there. Well, I just wanted to share that with you. I'm going to get back and add a few drinks. Now I'm going to finish off with the rest of this. I just opened it up and took one shot. And I'm gonna mix this and then I'm gonna mix this one. Alright people. That's my little blog. Have a great day.